Okay, so LeVar Ball basically had a couple of uh, ring of interviews recently, and it's been making a lot of headlines because it's LeVar Ball. Uh, LeVar Ball says Alan Foster forged documents and will be prosecuted. So what's going on right now with Alan Foster and, and, and LeVar Ball is fucked up because they're both selling big baller brand merch. LeVar Ball clearly is the real owner. LeVar Ball, LaMelo, LiAngelo, Lonzo. The Ball family is the owners of the big baller brand. It's quite obvious. But he's trying to say that Alan Foster forged some sort of documents, which is allowing him to basically sell big baller brand on his website. So he's making money off a of big baller brand right now. And I'm like, who's really buying shit off of Alan Foster? Are they getting duped? I feel like, well, he said something about um, when you go to Big Baller Brand website or you do something, it, click, it it brings you from one link from his website to Alan Foster's websites to make purchases. So there is some absolute fuck shit going on with Alan Foster and Big ba and uh, LeVar Ball for Big Baller Brand in, in court. So there's some heavy litigation going on. I don't think... Uh, it's the smartest thing to speak about these type of things if you're LeVar Ball or Alan Foster as it's going on. But them two really, don't, they don't care. They're pretty vocal. Um, Alan Foster has issued some statements. I haven't um, checked for them because who really gives a fuck about Alan Foster at the end of the fucking day? But uh, <laughs> Now, nah, if I'm going to cover the story, I check for it. Um, I, I, I hear Alan Foster's uh, statements, but Alan Foster's full of shit. Like I hear him and it's like goes in one ear and out the other. Man, it's just talking garbage.